Welcome to Brit Lab and today we're asking, do diet drinks make you fat? It's a bit of an odd question given that diet drinks were invented to help us lose weight, but some studies have actually shown that the consumption of these drinks is associated with weight gain. So what could be causing this? The idea behind diet drinks is that they use artificial sweeteners instead of sugar, which we all know is bad for us. Not only does all that sugar rot our teeth, but pouring empty calories into our systems is leading to increasingly overweight populations, as well as a higher level of obesity and type 2 diabetes. So let's see what happens in our bodies when we drink artificial sweeteners rather than sugar. I've got Ben here helping me out. Thank you very much, Ben. And what we're going to do is we're going to use ourselves as guinea pigs to see if there's a difference in our blood sugar before and after these two different drinks. Ben's drink is a standard sugary drink and mine is an artificially sweetened drink. And we're going to each of us test our baseline blood sugar and then we're going to try some of our different drinks and see after 20 minutes whether that has given us a sugar spike. So Ben's just going to prick the end of his finger with this and hopefully get a baseline sugar reading. 4.6, that's Ben's baseline on an empty stomach. My turn now. Let's put a bit of blood on the end there. And that one is showing 4.2. So although our baseline blood sugar levels are slightly different. Cheers, Ben. Cheers. What we really want to know is how will each reading change after we have our fizzy drinks? Let's see what happens in 20 minutes. Yeah. <laughs> So here we are coming back again to see whether there's any difference in our blood sugar having had the two separate drinks. So Ben, are you going to go first? Looking forward to doing this again, I'm sure. <laughs> wow, that's a change, isn't it? So it's gone up to 6.5 from 4.6. There we go. 4.4, so mine has gone up a little tiny bit. It's not a big change. So artificial sweeteners work in that they keep our blood sugar low. But why have some studies suggested that they're contributing to weight gain? The interesting thing is that some of the research suggests that because my brain has been sent a message by the sweetener saying calories are on the way, but then hasn't been delivered those calories, that my reaction will be now not just to go and have something to eat, but eat more than I usually would, hence pushing on weight. It's an interesting theory, but more research is needed on how artificial sweeteners affect what's called the food reward pathways in our brain, and whether this leads to increased appetite. So there you have it, no conclusive proof that diet drinks make you fat. I might just stick to water though. Why not share your own fizzy drink stories in the comments section below? For weekly updates, tips and ideas, please subscribe to BritLab.